what it is, what it do, side of the world. It is your girl, the one, the only, Ash Said It. AshSaidIt.com, AshSaidIt.com. Welcome to the Ash Said It daily podcast show. I appreciate you guys for all of your love and support. Over 1,500 episodes and half a million streams worldwide. None of this would be possible without you guys, so I thank you so, so very much. And yes, we are still living a bit of a quarantine life. You know, COVID-19 has changed life forever. But that doesn't mean that you can't still take care of yourself, right? Self-care is always the best remedy for everything in life. So I am speaking with the wonderful Savannah today from Bear and Bloom. Hey, Savannah. Hi. How are you doing today? I'm doing well. Happy Sunday. Yes, yes. So, Savannah, what part of the country are you at right now? So right now I am in South Carolina, Polly's Island, South Carolina. Um, I'm born and raised here in the area. Okay, cool beans. So let's talk about your brand. So how did Bear and Bloom come to be? That's interesting. Uh, that's an interesting story. So it all kind of began whenever um, I had my daughter Lily. Um, you know, Whenever you're pregnant, you know, they, they prepare you, you know, uh, with how to eat during the pregnancy, mm-hmm. you know, put it on your, your butter, on your stomach, on your thighs, try to minimize the stretch marks, things like that. You know, they teach you about self-care mm-hmm. during pregnancy, but after the baby comes, they really just kind of leave you hanging. So mm-hmm. I had these, like, these things that were happening to me, and I was just like, you know, what the heck? Nobody prepared me for this. And yeah. I would speak to the women in my family, and they'd be like, oh, yeah, you know. So a couple <laughs> of things that I was dealing with <laughs> is I had, you know, hyperpigmentation around mm-hmm. my face and my neck from all the hormones. And then about, you know, four months after I had her, I had gobs of hair falling out like Aww. enough to make a wig it oh, was goodness. thin thin mm. so on top of all of that you know I was also breastfeeding Lily yeah. so I didn't want to put anything on myself that was going to maybe like get into you know her mouth in yeah. some way you know because you're always touching your face yeah. and your hair you know whether you know it or not so You know, I started doing some research on some natural ingredients that would help with, you know, hyperpigmentation and hair loss. Mm. And I started discussing it with my husband, Ahmed, who has, he has a a science background. Mm. And we started researching these natural ingredients and um, putting together these different elixirs for myself. And they actually worked and they worked really Mm. well. And um, I would, you know, make batches and give them to my friends and family, and everybody would rant and rave about them. So uh, from that, we kind of got curious with other things that we've been experiencing. You know, uh, Ahmed, he's Egyptian, so he has really, really, really coarse hair, and shampooing his hair has always been extremely difficult because it dries it out, and it makes it frizzy. You know, it was hard for him to find any sort of product that would would help him with his really coarse hair. So from that, we also um, figured out what blend of natural butters, you know, would actually soothe his hair, make it nice and soft, and without having to do the traditional shampoo route. Right. So from that, we just kind of expanded on the things that worked for ourselves. And the things that we started using in our daily lives, and we decided to, you know, let's just make this into, you know, our our own line. You know, why not? We have the knowledge, and, you know, we would be kicking ourselves if we didn't give it a try. Mm -hmm. So that's that's how, you know, the company has uh, come about, and um, it really, you know, it's, it's, um, it's, it's, something that that we really really love to do we really enjoy the products that we make and we use them personally you know the company came about because these are products that we use right so as you and your husband were in development and really trying to figure out to cultivate and getting the product to market what were some of the challenges that Mm -hmm. you guys faced right well some of the challenges that we faced um would be with um, the having to scale down the line to things that 
you know, uh, it, instead of having like, you know, 50 things we wanted to sell, we had to cut that in half and really focus on, um, well, let's, let's perfect these, let's make these marketable and we'll see if, uh, you know, see if they take off and then we'll see if we will add more items later on. Mm -hmm. Um, and another thing that we really had to kind of focus on was, um, the social media aspect, Mm -hmm. the website, you know, you have this concept in your mind and you want to bring it out there and, but you have to, um, set up a website and get out there on social media and things like that. And it really, you know, it took us a lot of perfecting our strategy, and we're still perfecting to this day mm. on on how to, um, you know, do things in a, in a most cost efficient way. You know, and it was it was scary for us because we our kickoff date um, was right whenever the whole world shut down with with COVID. Mm. So we were kind of we had the startup that we had been planning for for a year, and then everything just kind of shut down. So we really had to um, re-strategize and look at um, our finances to to say, okay, you know, we need to try to take care of this ourselves instead of paying for it. So, you know, we had to learn about marketing and uh, web design, things like that. Yeah. Wow. Well, it looks like you guys have come a long way and you're certainly making yeah. a splash out there, which is awesome. Amazing. <laughs> Um, so for you personally, what would you say has been your proudest moment? My proudest moment would probably have to be, uh, we received this review from uh, a customer and it was, it was really heartfelt and she reached out to us to let us know that she had, um, she, she had cancer Mm. 10 years ago. And she had to go through uh, chemotherapy and mm. radiation. And from that, um, her hair was always really wiry and coarse. It changed yeah. how her hair, her hair texture. And she said that uh, for the first time in 10 years that she actually, she actually likes her hair now. And she can Aww. tell a difference in her hair. And it's, you know, much softer and manageable. So that right there, I was like, you know what? I was like, you know, we're absolutely doing what we're, you know, what we should be doing. And it just made me feel so good that we could make an impact on somebody like that. Because with, um, you know, with the, the products that, that we we have, you know, they're, they're for everybody. They're for any age, you know, any, any type of skin, hair, you know, they're for everybody. Mm. So... The fact that she had to go through one of the, you know, most difficult things that somebody can go through, and our products were able to remedy mm. the side effects of chemo and radiation, it was just really, really touching. Yes. Wow. So let's talk about the current line. So what are some of the products that you guys offer now? So one of my favorites is our Ulyon, and that is, it's our glow serum, and it's, um, it, that's the product that I made for myself to help with my hyperpigmentation, mm-hmm. and it is awesome. It <laughs> absorbs so quickly on the skin. You can even wear it underneath your makeup. Mm-hmm. You know, men can wear it, and it. And since the uh, the serum, it has this really nice amber color to it. It makes your skin glow, mm-hmm. and I put it all over my face, my neck, and my chest. It's one of my favorites. Yes. And then we also have. Um, the hat trick. The hat trick is also the um, the hair treatment that I made for myself whenever I lost all my hair from having Lily, and that's a pumpkin seed elixir, and it's a two week treatment, and I use it monthly. It's, mm. it's, I make sure that every month I use it for two weeks straight, and it really helps with any sort of shedding and breakage with the hair. You know, we also have um, the the Uso Naughty. Now that's the blend mm-hmm. of butters that. Um, you know, it's, it's meant for hair with coarse texture, and that's what Ahmed uses instead right. of you know having to do the the shampoo route. Right. Um, and we we also have um, we have shave products. You know, we have uh, uh, shaving butters, and um, we have baby products as well. Mm. You know, we have mm-hmm. nipple. Yeah, we have nipple butter for women who are breastfeeding. Yes. So that's another thing too. Yeah. Whenever I was breastfeeding, I. Yeah, I did not want to put anything 
um, on that area that I had to put my baby's mouth on. So I was like, I'm not going to put anything from the store on there. So that's whenever I also made our our club areola, you know. So we have, you know, really safe nipple cream. We have um, baby balm. We have a lot of different things um, that that are very useful in everyday life. Yes. And you guys actually are running a giveaway right now on Instagram. Tell us about that. We are. Yeah, so we are running a giveaway. It is for our Puffer Buffer Eye Serum, mm. and this stuff is it's wonderful. It comes in a little rollerball applicator. It's small enough to stick down in your pocket or your purse, <laughs> put in you know, your um, bedside table, and it is an eye serum that helps with the puffiness and the, the blue and red um, under eye pigmentation that gives you that dark, heavy, you know, lidded look. So we are running our giveaway um, until October the 25th. You mm-hmm. can um, enter into um, your, a chance to get it for free. So, mm-hmm. yeah, I would recommend anybody who wants to try it, you know, go ahead and enter into the, the giveaway. Yes. And, Savannah, what's the best way for people to reach you guys, of course, to check out the products and to follow you on social yeah. media? Yeah. So um, we are on Instagram at um, you know, Bear and Bloom Naturals. We're super responsive. Uh, we manage all of our social media accounts ourselves. So if you ever, you know, have a question, you know, you can just DM us and we'll respond right back to you. Because it's me and Ahmed who, who is, um, you know, taking care of all of that. Yeah. I love it, love it. Savannah, thank you so much for joining us today. We appreciate you. Yeah, I Jeff. appreciate you having me on. Certainly, and much more success with you guys. Definitely keep me in the loop. I definitely want to know when there's new products. I know as the months go on and we get out of quarantine life, there's going to be some more stuff with you guys. I definitely want you to come back to talk about it. I definitely love to hear about all the new products you guys offer. And I appreciate each and every one of you guys for all of your love and support. Keep in mind, anyone to tell you that you can't do what you want to do, you look them square in the face. You tell them, don't believe me. Just watch. Watch what I do. Watch me make it happen. Watch me make history. That's what we're doing this for, the history books. Social media is nice, but real life is so much better. Until next time, you guys.